Hey guys, welcome back to my tutorial. And today I will be discussing about merging photos in Photoshop. Yes, it is the same topic as last week tutorial. The reason I'm I'm still discussing about this topic is because uh, a week before I got a question from my friend asking why don't you try this technique I mean using automate and photo merge uh, the reason is to be honest I have never used this technique but today I think I, I wanna give it a try so let's give it a try so go to photo merge and browse your photo there is there are my photo click open I want to take geometric distortion correction yes I want to click that and click ok my point today is I want to show you the difference of this technique I mean using automate and last week technique I want to see is there is any difference or not and if there are no difference at all I think I will stick with automate because that obviously will save me a lot of time because I don't have to move the photos one by one so anyway, let's wait until Photoshop finish rendering everything here. It's taking a bit of time. Still aligning. Alright, almost finished. Anyway, if you have any question or yeah, any question about Photoshop, just email me or post a comment below. I will try to answer them all. Although I'm not a pro Photoshop user, but you know, I still want to share what I have in my mind so it's almost done here creating seamless composition all right so finish and let's crop it first go to crop tool and simply drag the corner here so yep Maybe a bit more and a bit more to the left a little bit up and a little bit down right so click that tick and there you go I think let's compare it side by side or yeah let's compare it that way so this is last week I mean the upper one is last week using last week technique and the lower one is this week technique you can see here it's about the same it's just a matter of how you crop it really yeah so I've, I've come to the conclusion here if you want to save a time use automate technique I think yeah alright that's it for today thank you for watching bye bye